Hey, this is Matt from MasterSketchup.com, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to take your scrapbooks panel and place it in its own tray. That way, you have much more room to look at the scrapbooks and navigate through the scrapbooks in layout. So by default, you'll find the scrapbooks panel over in the default tray. And what we want to do is create another tray that we can place um, inside layout as well. So to do that, you just go up to the window menu and select new tray. And from here, you'll create a name for it. So I'll just call it scrapbooks. And you want to select the panels that you want in the new tray. So in this case, I want scrapbooks. Now, panels can only reside in one tray at a time. So by checking this off, it's going to remove scrapbooks from the default tray and place it into my new tray. So I'll click add. And you'll notice down here, we now have this tab structure. So we can navigate back and forth between our different trays. And with the scrapbooks expanded, you can click and drag the boundary of the of the panel to give to fill the entire space of the tray. So it just gives you a lot more room um, instead of having to resize and work with all the different panels in one tray by pulling scrapbooks out and putting it in its own tray makes it a lot easier. The other thing that's cool is you can double click on the trays and that will pull them out and you can actually position them anywhere you want. So you could probably have the default tray inside the window. If you have dual monitors, the scrapbooks tray you might have off to the side in a second window in, in your second monitor. So that's just a quick tip to uh, get um, a secondary tray in layout. You can move additional panels to your new tray by going to window and selecting the tray that you want to move panels to and then selecting the uh, the panel. So if I wanted to move the instructor panel over to the scrapbooks tray, I can click that and you'll see my scrapbooks tray is now active and I have the scrapbooks and the instructor in it. And if I go back to the default tray, you'll notice that the scrapbooks and instructor have been removed from it. So I hope you found this tip helpful. And if you'd like to learn more about SketchUp and layout, check out my website at mastersketchup.com.